guys, Rick Dane with the Cowtown USA. I hear a brand new all in Murrow uh, in a 16 foot garage. Now, normally I just say the trailer, but I'm gonna take you into the inside. I think that's what, what y'all want to see first. Got your step, big handle here, put your hand in here. Got your screen door. Well, the first thing you're gonna notice is the hickory interior. And I'm gonna show you here the wide steps as you go in right to right, <coughs> excuse me, to the side of the bed. I really, that's one of the, the big deals in these trailers. <coughs> well, the first thing you're gonna see is the woodwork in the trailer. I mean, it's solid hickory. There is no wrap in it at all. And you can see the size of the crown molding. It's massive. You see the saddle scrolling in the ceiling. This is something when you pull into a campground, you just don't see. I mean, when people walk in these Murrah trailers, <clears throat> if it's not wow, the first thing you hear, it is we've done something wrong. You got storage all around the top head of the bed. It's a flat screen TV at the foot of the bed. And I'm just gonna shoot your view here from the top. Now, can you imagine yourself sitting on this couch, tired and wore out, kick up your feet there, got your fireplace going, favorite television show on, I mean, guys, this is a nice, nice unit. We've, we've done a really nice job specking this trailer out. Soft touch walls. You can see the storage. Most of the time, under the, under the dinettes, it's usually water tanks or under the couch water tanks. This is a storage under both these units. The water tank is outside of the trailer where the other tanks are. Okay, step down from here. <clears throat> Step over here, show you how the depth of these drawers and how simple they are. This couch is going to make into, or dinette's going to make into a bed, and it's got your upgraded high gloss countertop. Again, the saddle scrolling that matches the ceiling. Here again. And then we're backed up here with with gator on the trim and it's all recessed i mean guys this is not a this is not a 10 penny nail this is screwed in this is made to go off road with and the difference in the hickory and the makes these trailers one of a kind i mean this is you'll never see another one like it because it's simply the wood grain is completely different <clears throat> look at the wood grain on this door I'll try to match that up. Okay. Got your upgraded day and night shades. See through it in the daytime. Pull it down at night. Or if you want to look, look outside or open your window, you can do that as well. It's all the way around. All right. This has also got your upgraded... Uh, countertop and you see how shiny it is dual stainless steel sinks recessed cooktops you can set your pots down here an extended cabinet let's see here that's your nice big oven all right this has got your freezer gas electric fridge gas electric All soft touch. Just wipe it down with the sponge. Another example of the hickory. I hope this is showing up like I'm, I'm hoping it will. Okay, let's see. Try to move slow. Again, the gator pattern here. If you walk in here. Turn some lights on. Okay. 
in solid wood. Got a nice vanity. Get back up here. Nice hanging closet. Come over here. Storage and more storage. You have a nice radius shower. Here you see your your vents in and floor for your for your furnace. The AC is ducted as well. And I just kind of a glimpse of this as far as we talk about the hickory wood. Guys, this door, this is not a a hollow car hollow core door. This is solid hickory. Runs on a track. There again, you see the scrolling in the ceiling. Yes, this trailer is absolutely, yeah, to me, is absolutely gorgeous. All right, let me take you in the back. You got a 16 foot garage. Try to show it all to you. So this weight is 10,840 pounds. Approximately 10,840 pounds. Okay, I'll walk you out of this. Okay. Guys, is this, is this a class act or not? I mean, can you see yourself in this? That's, I guess that's the whole thing right there. Can you see yourself sitting here? <clears throat> Somebody's doing the cooking. It's going to be a he or she one for sure. You got your dual hydraulic jacks. Got your outside load light. You have a six-foot Norco slide. Be satellite inlet, TV antenna, soft touch walls, inner spring mattress, uh, six gallon uh, uh, gas hot water heater, 19,000 BTU furnace. You do have your couch and your dinette. Most of them are just one or the other. This, this unit has both. <clears throat> Excuse me. Oh, let's see what else can I tell you about it. Uh, we've got the upgraded. Uh, pewter color, pewter metallic uh, skin on the outside, aluminum wheels. You have dual jack controls on the front. I'll show that to you as well. Here you flip up camp, camper step on the outside. It is upgraded to convection microwave. Let's see here. It does have the wine guard. Uh, G2 satellite system and I made a mistake guys. It's not only been upgraded to the uh, Gas electric, but it's also been upgraded to the gas electric 10 gallon Okay, I think that's about all I need to tell you about in here. We have upgraded the spread axle a lot of people like that uh, And we've also upgraded with the with the dual awnings. And I'll step out there and show you that as well but You can see the hickory there Again, no vinyl wood, no vinyl wrap in this trailer. One of a kind. Okay, take you outside now. Your big outside windows here, both sides. Your 14 ply radio tires, aluminum wheels, and there's the spread axle that we were talking about. Got your camper step here by, by your rear door. Get your full rear ramp. The back end of this dude. Just simple things like grease fittings. A little bit of grease, a little bit of maintenance. This trailer will last forever. It is all aluminum frame or floor. And not just like some of these campers say that they're all aluminum. I mean, this is actually some strong structure underneath it. You got your low tail lights, high tail lights, and brake lights as well. All that just means is the semi that's behind four cars behind you can actually see what you're doing. You got your windows for cross ventilation so you can kick your uh, max fan on. 
Open these side glasses, side windows, same way up here at the bed. You'll pull some cross ventilation without actually having to use your air conditioning. Your dual hydraulic jacks with your separate controls. Got your aluminum battery box and you have your main kill switch here. Shuts all the power off from the inside of the living quarters. Upgraded dual propane. It's got a place for you to haul your water and to dump your water here, your drinking water. Got your jiffy jack here in case you do have a flat and lift your trailer. Guys, I don't know what else to tell you. Murr House been around since uh, 1956. <clears throat> Their claim to fame is horse trailers. Uh, longest horse trailer manufacturer in, in, the, in North America. We've been doing these now for uh, a bunch of years. Good people, great people on them. Can't say enough about Dennis and, and his son. I appreciate them very much. You know, my deal is right now just getting the product, just getting it to offer to you guys, to y'all. Anyway, give us a call, 573-885-6300. CowtownUSAINC.com, CowtownUSAINC.com, and little town called Cuba, Missouri. 573-885-6300. Thanks, guys.